Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Sword and Shield, but mostly Shield, because I'm cheap and I'm not going to buy both versions. I'm just playing Shield. Anyway, last time we made it through the uh, most uh, extraordinary named place in the entire game, Galar Mine number two, but now we're on the Moto Stoke outskirts, and we found an amulet coin. Prize money received during battle goes up. All right, nice, nice. Um, anyway, long story short, I had to just go through uh, Galar Mine number two, Electric Boogaloo, again, because I forgot to save after playing last time. Yeah. So, if some of the Pokemon's levels look a little bit different, or um, maybe some items that I have might look a little bit different, or anything like that, it is because I just blasted through uh, the cave, basically just hooked up NyQuil and he put everyone to sleep. Uh, nothing fancy. But um, yeah, so I really don't feel much like playing right now. <laughs> Considering I just played for 20 minutes before recording, usually I like to hop in fresh, you know, just start recording and start playing at the same time. I don't have stamina to play video games like I used to whenever I was younger. I guess I could say, I could say like when I was a kid. I'm, I'm not a kid anymore. I'm like, Gonna be pushing 30 here soon. No. Definitely not the same. But anyway, this Yamper isn't the same after he caught Panda Brand's foot to the face. Am I right? <laughs> we gotta level up. Nice. All right. We have here Swoobat. Okay, Swoobat might pose. Um, Swoobat might be psychic, I think. So if he doesn't kill us with this flying, okay, never mind. He's gonna totally kill us with this flying attack. All right. Oh, Panda Brand, you did good. You did good. Can't bring him out again. Uh, yeah, see, Nyquil is now level 27. He was not level 27 before. Uh, let's take out Thorfinn. And uh, definitely a payback to the face. Ought to handle this guy here. Another air cutter, but not very effective against steel. Last time we met Kabu Terimon, the gym leader. Gym leader Kabu, fire type, which we are honestly. Hey, Thorfinn got a level up too. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, it seems you're already quite used to Pokemon battles. Yeah, we've been doing this for. Uh, for. I think five hours now is what the playtime is. Can we read these signs? Yeah, we can read these signs. Yeah, awesome. All right, let's see. I, there was an item down there that I picked up, but I had to cut that out because it was uh, just not good. There we go. And we'll have Eldegoss come out because they are currently the lowest level in our party. And uh, they need to level up a little bit, especially being a grass type. Going up against the next is going to be a fire type gym leader. Oh, and what do you know? I should have figured that a police officer would have a Growlithe. Um, I think we can beat him though. If I can sing. Yeah, we got the sing off. That is such an ugly animation. That those seeds are hanging there in the air whenever we're singing. That's that's quite ridiculous. I I think the Pokemon team, animation team, whatever, should have uh, should have done better. That's pretty awful. Round. All right. Oh, and he woke up. Flame wheel. This is gonna hurt. Oh, you know we could beat him. That's the strongest attack we can. We can beat him. He just has to not crit. Just don't crit. Or you can just be really, really stupid. You can just be really stupid. Either one. I mean. I really should someday play like a mod of uh, online Pokemon games where the uh, the computers actually have like some semblance of intelligence when picking their moves. Honestly, that face though, uh, he doesn't look like he would have much, uh, I don't know, intelligence might be the nicest way to say that. All right, a genius feather. Pretty sure these feathers give you um, kind of like calcium and protein and stuff like that. Pretty feather, yeah. Oh, another one. A genius feather, again. What are we gonna get this time? 
Muscle feather? Yep. Wow, I was actually, I didn't remember that that was an actual feather. I just made that name up. You don't want to battle. You probably want to sell us something with wild points. Nope, nope, just telling us about poke jobs. That's cool too. All right. Ta-da. I get to Pokeball every time I talk to you. That's right. Answer is Ball Guy. Now, should I have been talking to Ball Guy the whole time? I think I think if I do that, then I actually get more from him, like different Pokeballs. Bring the Midnight Oil, are we? If you're here for the gym challenge, won't be able to won't be able to challenge Gabu until morning. For now, it's best to simply get yourself a good night's rest at the Badoo Drop Inn. Yeah. Yeah, because, you know, can't fight at night. <laughs> that would be crazy. And I, I, if I remember correctly, they really railroad you into going in here. Um, I think something stops you. No, no, nothing is stopping me. Uh, yeah, I, from what I remembered, I remembered something like you couldn't even go left on the screen past uh, the Badoo drop in. but I must have been mistaken. Let's go down here and explore. Down here by the docks. I'm sure there is an item or something. I sense great potential as a trainer and you come back whenever you're the champion. Um, what would that be down here when we fish? What is this? Hmm, is it just gonna be like a goldeen or what are we gonna get? Oh man, okay. What do you know? A Chumley? Whatever his name is. <laughs> Joodle. <laughs> oh man, I kinda wanna... <laughs> uh, I wish... Uh, wish I would name one of those Chumley someday. Alright, absolutely nothing of importance is down here, except whenever we uh, beat the main story of the game, we can come back and see what that guy has for us. Probably like a stamp on our league badge or something. <laughs> Oh, hey, I see something shiny over here. What is that? An X accuracy. Yeah. Uh, it's so soothing to see Pokemon playing in the city. Yeah, sure, whatever, man. Whatever floats your boat. See Pokemon playing in the city. What are you guys looking at? I'm admiring the graffiti. Uh, the gym leaders battle each other separately from the gym challenge in order to determine who is stronger, I guess. I, I mean, it has to happen, right? Because apparently some gym leaders are stronger than others. Silk Scarf. And what do we have over here? More shinies. A Poke Doll. Not to be confused with a Poke Ball. And just a long stretch here. Uh, why not is not playing Hopscotch, right? And we have the station down here. You look important. Nope, you don't have anything. Okay, I, he looked like he would have something for us, but. I guess not. It's whatever. I'm not upset. You look like you might have something for us, too. Nope. Just talking about League Guards. Alright, let's go to the Badoo Drop in because I'm pretty sure we get our Pokemon healed up. So, skip going to the Pokemon Center, go straight to uh, Badoo Drop in. If it isn't Marnie and uh, Diet Zero Pikachu. Caffeine free Pikachu. Freaking. Zero sugar Pikachu. And of course she wants to battle because uh, you need at least like three rivals for Pokemon game now, I'm not pretty sure. And uh, this is probably. I, I think Marnie is a dumb character. She's cool concept wise. I think she should have been your main rival. I really think Marnie should have just been the main rival, even if you, like, were to pick female as a... Uh... Oh, this is not good. We, we don't want Eldegoss out right now. And I did not get to heal. This is really not good, actually. Um, I would take out Thorfinn against the Krogunk, but fighting beats steel. Um, let's just take out Nyquil. Our best bet. Yeah, I think Marnie's a dumb character. Um, I don't know why they put her in this game. It, she doesn't feel necessary. I don't think you need three rivals in a Pokemon game. 
I don't think you do. Two would be good enough because like I understand how Pokemon wants there like now Pokemon wants there to be the good guy, nice rival like Hop, and they want there to be the mean butthole <laughs> rival like Bead. You know they want the Gary Oak and they want uh, I don't know who the first like nice rival would be. Um, who was the first like nice rival? May. May or whatever the other guy's name is in third gen. I forget what his name is. His name is like Cedric or something weird. Why am I not hitting? Am I just not reading some text that was supposed to be happening here? <laughs> oh boy. Um, I will say Marnie's music is also very fun. Okay, I need to pay attention. Um, let's do Home Claws. We go first, so Payback is not going to be nearly as effective. Crowbunk is going to use Revenge. This is terrible. This is really bad. Um, I might have to end up using a Max Revive or something. Nope! Oh, no! No! Oh, man. I... Almost. Almost, man. But almost only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. Let's see. Panda Brand probably outspeeds him. Hey, what is this? Just an orange berry as soon as you switch out? That? I didn't even know that that actually works that way. Um, let's just use a slash. Oh no, she uses a super potion. That's nice. That's great. That's back to full health, too. Okay, slash. Hopefully do at least half damage. Yeah, okay. I just still don't know if I outspeed you, because I can always go first, but I do outspeed you. Here we go. Here we go. Now, what do you have? You have, uh, you have zero calorie Pikachu, and you have Scraggy. Okay. What is Scraggy? Like a dark ground or something again? I don't know. I can circle throw, get him out of here. This is a headbutt. Okay, okay. What? I missed? Or no, can Scraggy just not get ejected? Ah, oh, crap. Okay, um. Let's try a payback. No. Do we tie in speed? Because he went first before. sweep. Hey, why didn't I do that sooner? He's a dark. <laughs> dark type, why didn't I use fighting? Ah oh, man, okay, I'm really losing it. I think I'm nervous, and I'm trying to like talk at the same time. More Pekko, that's his name. More Pekko, not more a Pekko, just more Pekko. How much Pekko? I don't know, just more. More Pekko. Um, he has... He switches types, right? I don't know, neither of those really matter. Thundershock. We're dead. We're dead, okay. Alright, let's do a 1v1. Eldegoss versus More Pekko. Angry More Pekko. Alright, um, we've been successful the last few times that we've used Sing, but lowers their speed stat. I don't want to do that. If that did something like Paralyze, that would be amazing. Um, we could just leave Tornado and pray, or we could try to be cheeky and use Sing. Um, I'm not going to risk it. I'm just going to try to leave Tornado till I die. I think this move expresses my feelings. What do you think? Use Bite. Yeah, sure. I mean, oh, I flinched. Wow. Excellent. Um, this is not good. He might lower his accuracy. More Pekko uses Bite. Ah, oh, jeez. This is not... And flinched again? No. No, the game is really... No. No, whenever the game flinches me twice in a row, that's when I pull out a Max Revive. I don't care. I really don't care. Um, yeah, and I'm definitely using Lump Dwarfin. Like... 
No, this game's the game is playing me. I don't even care. And I'm gonna use another revive. Actually, I should use just a super potion on Eldegoss. No. Mm, yeah. Yeah, like usually I don't use items like this, but when the game when the game wants you to flinch two times, it's playing you, bro. No, I play the game. The game does not play me. <clears throat> there will be none of this. None of this jargon going on right now. Quick attack. Look, he even tried to be cheeky. He thought... Oh, oh he fought. He fought? Okay. And then now we're gonna fight. Good luck. I hope you flinch me or else you're going to sleep. Flinched again! <clears throat> Three! Three! Bro. Three times in a row. Again? No! What is- Hold on. Hold on. You just made me shift my whole entire body language in my seat. Okay. How is it flinching every single time, though? How- how is it flinching every single time? Something is up. <clears throat> okay. Let's use a metal fall. Use the bite. I swear, if it flinches four times in a row. Okay. Okay, this isn't enough damage. It's not very effective. Is it because he's electric or something? What? I don't know. I really don't know. Um, three flinches in a row. With bite. With a bite attack. You know how many times I've played Pokemon games and I've had bite and how many times I've flinched? Probably in my whole entire Pokemon playing career, I flinched someone with Bite three times. But you're gonna flinch me three times in a row? Of course, it's not very effective. Um, let's just see if we can use Metal Claw again, I guess. No chance. Okay. Let's put out Panda Brand. See what happens. Now, let's just slash. Let's see if we get a crit. Thunder Shot. All right. Slash. Can we get the crit? No, if we did get a crit, never mind. Um, if I super potion, watch me get paralyzed. Watch me get paralyzed by a thunder shock. <clears throat> All right, HP restored. I guarantee. I get. I would bet everything. It's gonna. Yep. Oh. Oh my. Oh, 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 this is so... Oh, watch me not hit. Watch me not hit. He's gonna use Thundershock. I'm going to be paralyzed. No, I use Slash. Okay. Oh my goodness. This is ridiculous. That was ridiculous. I mean, I know I went in not healed up completely, but that was actually... That made me a little upset. Yeah, and that stupid more peck of it should not be freaking off-brand Sam's Cola Pikachu. Dr. Thunder Pikachu. Mountain Lightning Pikachu. 
RC Cola Pikachu. Okay. Kaba's Lee card is supposed to be... It's supposed to help against him. Hmm? But I ended up with a few copies, so I'll give you one. I don't look so chuffed. Why are you giving me Kabu's League card? That's... And it's supposed to be like, what, good luck? Oh, burn heals. Okay, that's good. I bet you'll have no trouble beating that man of fire Kabu chap, right? Why don't you get over to Monostoke Stadium and get that gym bag already? Urara. We are going to head over. Um, but before we do, I think we're going to wrap up the episode. Oh man, everyone's talking about you. Go all out. Alright, let's get hyped for the next episode. The next time that we, that we come in here. The next time on Pokemon Sword and Shield. I will be taking on Kabu Terimon at the Motostoke Gym. Uh, it's supposed to be the, uh, the, the test... It sees if you're good or not, I guess. Anyway, um, with that, thank you for tuning in. Thank you for clicking on the video. Go ahead and like the video. Subscribe if you're not. Comment. I read every single comment, and I would love to read yours. Um, tell me how bad the audio sounds. Tell me uh, how I don't know how to play Pokemon good and all of that other fun stuff. Um, as far as uh, how much fun I had, I think that last battle was actually kind of fun, even though it was a little bit stressful and um, annoying, but it was <laughs> it was fun. Um, so I, I actually had a good time. I had a good time, despite having to play 20 minutes before even hitting the record button. But anyway, I think I'm rambling on. This video has lasted way too long. Uh, Dynamax makes your Pokemon become huge. Bye.